Actually, I probably should go for a line of Navy Tech TBH. Actually, probably would be useful. Yeah, let's go ahead and do this. This tech actually should get researched relatively quick. And then I'll let the org on this go all the way up, and then we'll send those guys down. Actually, are they still there? They are, what the hell? Yeah, you know what? I am going to go for a line of this, because if I do get the core any territory, then I could build uh, steamer convoys, and they're really useful. Alright, let's see. Can you guys accomplish this with six army tech? Uh, we got one ship. We have victory! Gentlemen, we're going in. I might have clicked 10% on that. Get in there, Marines. Take back the Moldives. Retreat! Ah, victory. Thank you for returning my lands, as you lose the last two ships in your fleet. Okay, we got our boys back. We'll next up that peace treaty. Oh, thank you! You are amazing. Ah, the empire grows once more. Alright, go ahead and send those guys up there. You are a, a trooper ship. I love you. You did a great job. Thank you. All right, gentlemen, you can head into the unknown sections. Go ahead and do Battleship Doctrine, because I'm going to have to build those up anyway. You are support troops. Go ahead and head here. All righty, we're going to hold out for a little bit. What I want to do is, I know it's 5.5, .5, so it's going to be 11. What I'd like to see is get us down to about 13 infamy go to war with the sick they only have persia on their side in terms of army tech they have 10 of 30 these guys have 10 of 30 i have all the army tech so the advantage lies with us so we can use that time wisely i can build up the defenses in this sector to ensure it holds And gives us a better survival chance. Upgrade yours. You already upgraded. There, you upgraded you. You're fine. Let's go ahead and actually just forge you up. Ceylon did its mission. Do yours. Oh, I did South Bengal. Did I do all of them? Oh yeah, we were already doing that. Upgrade this, upgrade that. Here's is fine, you're upgrading. You need upgraded. You need upgraded. You need upgraded, good. Go for steamers. It's pretty good. 
pretty good. And then we just need to conquer, I think, what was it, three provinces? Three regions, we need to conquer this, this region, this region, and then actually one, two, three, four regions here. So that's all I need to take from them. Personally, I'm thinking hit them here. Probably here too. That way I can push the line back. Um, let's go ahead and do electricity. Electricity can come in handy. Then I'm going to cut taxes back on these guys. Middle and the rich are at the same thing. That's really good. And then that should start getting us ready to go. It's actually really nice. Leon, Ethiopia, that ain't indigenous garrisoning. Now, well, personally, I don't see any lands I, I'd really need. We secured this. I mean, it gives me an access point to the rest. I just don't see a point in me going over here to conquer any of that. Most of my empire is down is through here. I don't really have any other territories I need. As I said, I'm going to hold out until we hit about 13, because I'd like to get several states. Well, actually, I could go for that. That's 5.5. .5. You know what? Do it. Because if I do the other, it's still... It's only a um, colony of theirs. They don't officially have it stated, so that's a 2.5. So in reality, we need about 8, which we're at the 8 counter right now. So if I do this now, I can end it now and get it done with. And then I only need two more states from them. Their capital... Or I only need two more regions. Their capital and their uh, the Kashmir territory. Which is probably a good move to go ahead and do the state one. Because 4.3 infamy is a lot better. 5.5. That's good. Go high pressure, low pressure, steam engines. Yeah, I'm thinking get the industry stuff going. If we can secure all this before 1900, it's really good for India. Suez. Can't do none of them. Colombia. Americans stop me if I tried to influence them. Highly likely they will. No, I'm not going to try. I was going to go for Colin, or I was going to try influencing some regions, but I'm leaning towards a no. Theoretically could hit Japan.
Nope, can't do anything to that. Don't have the territorial ability to go after that. Theoretically could go over here, but I have no reasons to go to Africa. I think my best bet is to influence Japan, though. Eighty-three percent. That's pretty good. Good for cheap iron production now. Well, theoretically, I could go after two of those. It's really down to do I want two states, or would I rather ha not have two states? I'd have to see what the work score is at, at that point. Probably will send these two here. Actually, I could probably send you two at them. And I'll have to see where we're at. Proton, right? Yep. All of you go in here. How much is the war score at? 23. If I add Kashmir, that adds 28. Could get out of this out of the way now, then come back to get the rest. Successfully did yours. Push here, push here. Successful. They lead in this assault. Oh, that's a side charge if I've ever seen one. Take the Mountain Province. Hit him from all sides. Head to their capital.
All right. So far, so good. Continue the push. They would accept. All right. Here, here, there, 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 there. Okay, and down here to the south as well. Semi automation. Okay, that's really freaking good then. Build up more of Japan. I see them as a long term investment plan. Perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Wow, our economy tanked. What the hell happened? Must have entered a depression. Build up our territories again. Japan, I will take that alliance, my friend. Thank you. Island. Great, you guys. Or... Economy's still not doing good. We must have hit a rough spot because it wasn't that bad before. Something in the economy across the globe must have crashed. Yeah, I'll, I'll say it'll recover on its own. It should be. Great old Kashmir. You're good, you're good. Secularized. That is this. That or Cheap steal it. All right, that's really good. That means we don't have that much more to go on. I just have to take state. I just need to take their capital. And I need to take that bottom section and then I think good. The Indo-British Empire. It's going to be a great night. All right, we'll influence Japan. She'll become my bitch. And we'll keep investing in her. I, I want a strong Japan. Iwo Jima! Got it. K 
Okay, again, the economy is not doing great. We're losing a lot of money. That's sphere of influence. The fact that they took Ukraine tells you how powerful these guys were at one point. It's kind of sad. 25 million versus my 45. So I do have the population advantage against them still, so if they try to influence me in some sort of way, I can easily come back to smack them. Even if full taxation on the middle class, I still couldn't do it. I'd have, even with full taxation on both those guys, I couldn't do it. Could we cut army maintenance back at all? I cut it back to 50% to try to offset what we're losing. That's about as best as I can do. I'm thinking instead of doing steel railroads, I'm going to do another line of commerce tech. It'll be good. I'll get five... Eight, nine, twelve. Twelve. That'd be 12% additional taxation. So I think that's what we'll do. We're just, we're just going to focus on in the commerce side of things for a bit again. Then do steel railroads. Because it's probably still taking time to even get the railroads I already have getting built, built. Good, they're doing great. I mean, we, we are doing fantastic, honestly. Taunt and Tibet. You know what? We could save Tibet. Let's do it. Let's safeguard our friends in the north. Go for that, do that. Eh, I really, I'd rather take control of Bhutan, Sikkim, and the uh, Nepalese. I'd rather take the Himalayas. That's just me. Tibet, not so much, because then, then you're starting to get into that fun Chinese area that I don't want to touch. Big question is going to be, is, are we going to be aiming for anything else after we take control of India? I'm thinking... I might eventually... I probably should just get ready to start hitting this, to be honest. When does this peace treaty officially end? 11th of April, 1891. It's about th two and a half years-ish. It's not bad. Again, we're still suffering from rebellions. I have to form India. I have to do it quick. Otherwise, those rebellions are going to get crazy here shortly. We are flatlining in the economy, so that's also not a good thing. I mean, theoretically, lowering taxes would be an offset to get the militancy down, because the lower the taxes are, the less likely people want to want to kill me. Theoretically, we can build in Kashmir. Are you kidding me? Oh, yes we can. I can build here. We're building up. Build a cannery. Um, cement. Because I'm going to just get the goods sent to you anyway. Textile mill. What else you guys got up here?
luxury goods. Well, fabric, because you guys actually do have that. That next. That sphere. There's the oil reserves that I really need. Yeah, that 5%, that cut that by half. I think, did I say 9 or 12? So, theoretically, it should offset after a bit. We really just need an industry going. Which, personally, to get the industry going, I'll probably cut back on military spending. By cutting this down to 30, this is going to go down to 50. I probably will raise the taxes on here, and then see where we're at. Where did we get oil, by the way? I've seen oil pop up. My eyes are going like 100 miles an hour trying to find this oil location. Uh, did they pop up in Russia yet? Yes. Cross me. Yes, I come back here. Okay, it popped up here in Awesome. Where Bengalese is the primary culture. That's good. So 1891. Okay, so we're getting very close to being able to do this next war. Um, uh, how much of my population actually is liberal? Fair bit. Wait, why did I hit 100% literacy and now it's down to 9.7? Uh, I bet I know where that came from. So, if mole dies, is it based only on... Is it solely based on states? If it is... My entire state of Moldives had 100% reading because it didn't matter to it versus the rest of the empire, which is all colonies. Crap. <laughs> so I might not have that literacy rate. <laughs> oh, that's going to be a fun one. Oh, I need to take over for India quickly, otherwise this is going to be a problem of epic proportions. This needs to be resolved now. Oh, I didn't think about that. That is funny. That really sucks. Its literacy rate theoretically would be much lower than what it is if it's based only on the Maldives. Does it say... No, because it says literacy rate is 9.8%. <sighs> Well, if it didn't, ca if that's the issue, I'm assuming that's the issue, then I'm not too sure then. It's really making me think. Uh, we're going to do market regulations first. Yeah, and then there's my funding getting hit again. is tanking. Got to increase taxes again. Alrighty, but I think I'm going to end the episode here. I think we had 30 minutes. I could be wrong. I think I'm right. I really think I'm right. It's really coming down to me just trying to figure out how to fix my economy. The amount of money being spent into education is it's cataclysmic for this nation. <laughs> I really need to foreign India. I have to do it quick. So we have to get this because militancy is starting to reach. 
I'd say a point of no return soon. So I definitely need to form quick so I can at least get the eastern section of the empire under my direct control so I can start building a ton of factories to increase our finances and hopefully calm down the militancy problems. Because if I, if I get at least a small portion of it cut into that, it hopefully will start fixing it. Uh, the only problem is it seems like we do have something cutting into the actual funding. So socialist is, I, I prefer it, but it is giving me problems. Um, I think everybody does have the right to vote. Well, no, they don't because they're still colonies. Crap. So yeah, that definitely does need to get fixed. Uh, so please like, subscribe, leave a comment down below. We come back, everybody. The burning of the empire as it tries to consolidate itself. We need to go to war with the sick again. Uh, we have until next year. Hopefully next year we take them, form India, and the game is then officially ready to go. So I'll see you then. Thanks.